ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm at the preview day here where they serve plentiful amounts of alcohol. And this is a six speed manual transmission Toyota Supra. This is a great way to start off the auto show. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today I am here at the New York International Auto Show and I am having an amazing time because this is the preview day. Yes, before it is open to the public, if you were able to make a generous donation to the East Side House, you're able to get into the auto show. So I get to look at some really cool cars before the general public does. So this is a beautiful car that Davin is opening the doors to because we have full access to this beautiful car. This is an LC500 convertible. A wonderful car that provides high-end performance. It's got cup holders. It's not quite the replacement of the LFA, but this is a wonderful substitute that we can have as a placeholder in the meantime until the regular car does arrive on our shores. Look at this wonderful interior with this beautiful stitching all across the seat bolsters. It is in static display, so you have access to the map, which is not showing an accurate depiction of where we currently are because we are at the Javits Center. What can you tell me about this wonderful car? All right, so I have LC 500. Yes. It's a V8 engine, 471 horsepower. Yeah. And the price range is in the hundreds. Hundred. 100,000. Yeah, in the 100,000. Yes. 100,000. That's not bad. Maybe a little, more, yeah. Maybe a little bit more. What you want in the package yes. The What's your favorite feature? My fav favorite thing is the heated seats. Yeah. And the heated steering wheel. Yeah. Because you're in New York, or actually I'm from Chicago, so yeah. I'm cold. So if I'm driving a convertible, I'm going to need that heated steering wheel. Of course. Yes. Would you drive this in the winter in Chicago? Not in the snow. Yeah, so the perfect option although, would be this car. Although you can get snow tires, because I just know that my family member had a Mercedes convertible and they yeah. change it to the snow tires. Yes. And then in the summer, they'll change it to the regular. So there is the Lexus LC500, a beautiful car. So thank you very much. I appreciate it, Karuti. This is the Mark Levinson sound experience. Wow, this interior is insane. This is insane. <laughs> like sweet the, the everywhere, bass? bro. Dude, the bass in this is amazing. God. Feels like a baseball man, bro. Yeah. And the fit and finish is just incredible. Like nothing beats this oh, Lexus. Man. Everything from head to toe. Bro. Yeah. Everywhere. Leather everywhere. Leather everywhere. As far as the eye can see, bro. Yeah. Wow. Details. Details matter. Yeah. This guy. <laughs> No plastic cover over this engine. And this is a new car. Well, it's a completely modified IS 600. Plus. 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 The vehicle's locked. They took out the back seat because, well, you know, Sparco and a roll cage and no music as compared to that one. Carbon fiber hood, beautiful wheels, Advan wheels with the proper Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires. Yeah. Really cool details. I like it. I approve. We are downstairs in the booth and I see this beautiful blue 911. Now, speaking of blue 911s that are at a car show, here is a little throwback of me at the car show last year. Take Alex Barris, whose car dreams have come full circle. I had a very similar car to this as a poster on my wall. One that says like, kills bugs fast. One of my favorite movies as a kid was Bad Boys. This is a 911 Carrera. The one car in the movie is a 964 Turbo, but it was close enough. And it's easier than ever for gearheads like him to connect. Support a museum. 
Support a museum support and you can museum. win a Porsche GT4. Support a museum. Yes. You see that Porsche GT4? It can be yours and you could be driving away in a blue Porsche just like me. This is a beautiful car. It is a PDK. It is not quite a six-speed manual. It is a GT4. That means you get ultra lightning shifting abilities, but it's the Saratoga Automobile Museum and it is one of my favorite car museums in the world. Right now, they currently have the 007 exhibit that I got to see at the Peterson Automotive Museum, but they have some of the most beautiful examples from the Wrap Factory. Beautiful cars, a lot of JDM imports. We have this awesome Maserati right over here. Martini livery Porsche 911. Let's go over here. This beautiful Stratos, Lancia Stratos. Wow, a 500E built by Porsche. Well, this is the Cultivated Collector. This is the Cultivated Collector, Matt Ivanhoe. Let's shout him out. He always has beautiful taste. What a beautiful car with the perfect AMG Penta wheels. Absolutely gorgeous. And of course, how can we look, how can we not see this beautiful, perfectly detailed Lamborghini Countach? Wow. Quarter panels, front fenders, front bumper. This is incredible, $35,000 for this kit. This is insane. The whole body panel under it, it's all closed off. Oh my it's, God. This yeah. kit is. Oh, it's, it's just for Aero. Yeah, so this kit has been wind tunnel tested. Wow. Uh, Damn. Wow. This is That's unbelievable. Crazy. If you're a fan of JDM, dude, top secret. Dude, look at the brakes. Those brakes alone. This is top secret, bro. Dude, top secret. dude, this is some of the best JDM cars you'll ever seen. Yeah. Oh, that that Impreza is special. Totally Type beautiful. R. Those are spoon wheels. Spoon. Uh, spoon mirrors. Yes. Bulk rays. E37s. Best wheel ever made for the JDMs. Cantilevered four cylinder to the side so it fits properly. Wow. Wow. I'm speechless. This is an AE86 AE Corolla. Rear wheel drive in perfect paint. Hachiroku. For those who know, you know. Jesus. Wow. Drift this is legend. So cool. These wheels, dude. Wow. Ashiroku. These oh, parts, man. this car. Prino. Wow. So, yes, it is. So, going back to these cars, these drift legends. What's the name of that famous movie where they drift in the mountains to Initial deliver tofu? Initial D. Initial D. If you have not seen Initial D, this is definitely the movie that you should see because these cars it's about delivering tofu but it's more about the art of drifting and that's one of the greatest movies ever made the best part of the show because this looks like a car museum like all the jdm stuff that we worship this kids because oh this is our God. generation yeah, definitely. this is our generation this is the stuff that we could afford yeah you know like i uh, couldn't I afford <laughs> i could not no no the only thing i could afford was that civic right over here oh, the bubble hatch yes and I wanted to get one only because it was a... Those things... It was only oh 3000 bucks, Yeah. like, on Craigslist. Now they're yeah. super expensive. K20 in that thing? Yeah. That thing will be destroyed. It's, it, absolutely. This is one of the coolest cars. This blue? Oh, my God. Wow. And I love the fact that it has road debris, just like my Porsche. <laughs> it's... You know what? It's, it's signifying the fact that it's used. That's what makes it special. The fact that it's being used... It's not being babied, it's not in a garage, it's not being trailered. That's what makes these cars special. That means it's being taken to the track and driven at insane miles per hour. Each and every single one of these Supras. Intake hole, beautiful, gorgeous. Who needs visibility anyway at night? Ooh, I like this camper van, it looks beautiful. That's exactly like my coffee maker. Yeah, yeah, this is a good coffee maker. These are the best. Yeah, these are the best. Yes, perfect car. Perfect W124. And this car is in immaculate shape. The W124 is a fan favorite. See, when you go to an event at the auto show, you have a lot of cars in their skeleton phase separated from their frame because they want to display things such as their battery packs. Their battery packs. I mean, battery packs. I'm not excited about these battery packs, but hey, 
This is where the future is going by 2030. This is one of the coolest cars here. This is the ID Buzz. This was here last year at the auto show. It is a fantastic little car that is paying homage to the 1960s VW Buzz. I love the two-tone palette. I love the somewhat of a neon color. I feel like it's ready for production and I'm allowed on the stage because that's what we're allowed to do when you come to the preview show. And I'm about to open the door. Wow. It's got little displays everywhere. This is quite the beautiful vehicle. It's got, wow. I'm a fan of this car already. The stitching, the woodwork. This is perfect, as they say, for the beach. What a beautiful car, no sunroof, which is okay. It reduces the stiffness of the chassis. They're speaking Italian, they said Spiaggia, which means the beach. Great car. Volkswagen has done it again. Fantastic vehicle with a cool presence. Nice. So ladies and gentlemen, that'll be it for me today here from the New York Auto Show. I want to thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one. Today's an exciting one. I'll see you later. Take care. Now I'm going to go hang with friends.